Mm. All right, here we go. Mm. Hi guys, this is Ken Yuzinski from catholicspeaker.com and this is Janelle Yuzinski. And today we're going to chat about one parenting tip. So a couple nights ago, I was at the computer and I saw this little note written by Janelle and it said, I love to watch you. And I'm like, hmm, a little creepy. <laughs> or is it romantic? I don't know. <laughs> And then I go upstairs a little while later and there's this note to, to the cabinets and again it's a little a note there and it says, I love to watch you. I'm like, hmm, is this, I don't know, should I reciprocate? So then I wrote down a little note and I put it right beside yours and it said, I love to watch you too. And then I realized it, it wasn't about me. <laughs> no. No, what was it about? Um, okay, so basically I'm reading this book and uh, there was this research, this study that was done of, um, you know, these athletes, you know, now in university and um, the researchers asked them, like, what, what was the best thing that your parents said to you um, as you were going through your training and, you know, developing your skill? And um, basically they just said the, the best thing that their parents said to them was, I love to watch you play soccer or I love to watch you play piano or I love to watch you, you know, color or, or draw a picture or, you know, just I love to watch you blank, fill in the space. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> so, um, and, and this study was done over three decades. So what does that mean for us as parents? Because we have four, mm -hmm. number five coming. Yeah. Uh, what does that mean for us then? It means that I can't be like hounding my children to practice their piano to the point where it needs to be perfect all the time. <laughs> because it steals the joy out of it for them. So I love to watch you play piano, mm -hmm. even though in your mind you're thinking it's not perfect. Yes. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. I love to watch you color, even though you've gone outside the lines. Mm -hmm. I love to watch you do math, even though in your mind you're thinking the answer is wrong doesn't mean we don't correct the behavior or the answer if it's math correction is good and necessary the statement communicates to the child i love you more than your performance you are more important than what you do you are first in my heart your activity is second mm -hmm. as parents we can encourage our children but less is more like to not have to you know always be criticizing them because then it steals the joy that they once had in this in this activity mm. Mm -hmm. okay because I think the temptation at least for me is to watch my children do an activity and then look for the fault in it and then give them a correction on so they can become better mm -hmm. which is good you want your kids to succeed but what the study showed is that they really value just simply knowing that mom and dad are just watching mm -hmm. and that they love to watch any other thoughts yeah. no well I still love to watch you. <laughs> That's it, everyone. Have a great day. God bless.